Welcome to Ron Wills Money Matters. Online businesses can be lucrative. Online businesses, I'm gonna tell you what, with the World Wide Web and um, everything, online can be very lucrative for you. It can be very lucrative. It's lucrative for ROM, and that just isn't just the social media, that's the obvious, but what if you selling something? You selling a product. It can be, it can be lucrative, but I mean, you're gonna have to do a few things. You're gonna have to do a few things, like, uh, like say you selling books online. That can be very lucrative. All you have to do is like, um, all you have to do is just really just put it out there, have a good CEOs and everything, the search, uh, search engine optimization, have that, have good tags, and just bring people to the site. Like one way you can do that is just, uh, no matter what you sell, maybe have a little blog with it or something like that. But here's the thing, however you do it, however you get people to your site, the beauty of it is you have a global audience. Seriously, then that's really it. You, if you have a global audience, and as long as it could be, and it could be whatever, you could be maybe uh, selling like eBooks or something like that. A lot of people talk about that. Or you could be doing affiliate marketing. You have something that keeps people coming back to your site and you know, they, they hit like the, uh, you know, you, you have an affiliate marketing, like say you get 25%, you know, you send people to another site to buy something. In fact, you have some people out there, that's all they have on their website is just affiliate marketing. Like on my website, I have, uh, I have like some books that I like to read. And you know, that's affiliate marketing right there. You know, people click the book, if they buy it, I get a cut. You know, and of course my main thing is the social media. And you know, social media is so prominent Yes, you can make money that way, but it's still the same principle. Customers. That's the beauty of social media. Whether you use social media, whether you have affiliate marketing, you have a bunch of people because, uh, you know, I quote uh, what Ray Kroc said about uh, McDonald's. He said he wasn't in the um, a fast food business. He was in the real estate business. It was all about location. When you talk about breaking more to stores, it's location, location, location. They have to be in the best location. That's why you have some businesses for public businesses. They'll pay. They'll, they will pay good money. They will pay maybe up to five figures just to figure out who live in a particular area. You know, what type of people. That's why when I see like different stores go up, I already have an idea. Okay, okay, this who live around here. This who live around here. This the type of people who would buy this. Like, uh, I live in... Um, Abend in Maryland, and I look at the stores, but also the stores further up in Bel Air, like around where the mall is and everything. And they got a lot of like furniture stores. So I say, okay, a lot of people moving around. They need stores. They got uh, like some uh, pet places, a couple pet places. I was like, okay, yeah, I see a lot of people with dogs around here. You know, they have. Um, you know, a store of Sprouts up there, you know, Sprouts sells more of that organic stuff. So I said, okay. Noticing yoga studios, okay. But see, that's in the area. See, the beauty of an online business is regardless of what you do, you do have a global audience. The only thing you really have to do, the only thing you have to do is just figure out how to get your stuff up. Now, of course, I mentioned search engine optimization. That's actually one of the best things, like the best tags and everything. So people looking up something. You don't even really have to advertise. People looking up something, they will look for you. Now you can advertise, but I'm just saying, you have the right tags on your business and you could be selling whatever. Just say, okay, let me, let me um, put some tags here. When people look it up, your business will come up. And the more people look it up, your business will come up. And then really, Here's what you do. Whatever your business is, I would say get on a TikTok, get on an IG, should get on a YouTube, whatever, to get people to your site. To get people to your site. And maybe even look into ads on something like a YouTube or even on an IG. I know you can like 
advertised because as I'm going through my IG, people always average, something's always being advertised or sponsored. Something's always. So that's a way, but what it does is, is get people. Now you might, the key to any business is not just getting the people, but getting return customers. So when you may be advertised at first, you might get three people. Or, you know, have you do it, uh, you have the right tags or something, you might get three customers and stuff. But if you keep going, that, that three becomes 30. That 30 can become 300. And depending on what you're selling, you can make a lot of money. But the thing is, you gotta be you gotta be consistent. Now, if you in a business where you mail in something, you mail in products out. All I would say there is mail it out quickly. Don't be waiting. You know, let people know and let people know exactly when it's going to come out. Like when you know people hit me up to get uh, signed copies of one of my books. Uh, that can go out depending on what time I get the payment. That can go out like that day. If I get it early in the morning or something, I'm like, oh, let me get this out. If I get it in the evening, it goes out the next morning. Anybody can say that. I was like, boom, okay, let me do it. It's like, and sometimes I'd be tired. I was like, oh man, wrap it up. Stop by the post office. They know me too. They know me when I'm bringing stuff in. But you want to be consistent. You want to consistently get the stuff out. And that's the thing, because like this one, and if, if not, just let them know, because there's some stuff I order online, some stuff, you know, some body stuff, you know, all of that. Uh, one of the things I found with them, they'll tell you, they'll, because I think what, what it is with them, they got to make up the stuff. So they tell you exactly, they say, okay, give us, give us a week, we'll get it out. And it's always on time. See, so you got to be consistent, but online, it can, the main reason online can be lucrative is you have a global audience. Any place that sells, I mean, shoot, any place they can like go to your website, you know, and depending on what country you're in, you can still ship overseas and all of that, depending on where you at. It costs a little bit extra, but eh, some people, they'll do it. They'll do it. Right, they'll do it. But even if you're just in this country, you got a global audience. See, the thing, the beauty of, I want y'all to think about the beauty of being online. The beauty of it. It's like it, somebody can somebody can go to your webpage or something while they just, they sitting on their couch chilling and they can find your webpage. They don't have to go out and walk or anything. They don't have to drive any place. They can order your stuff right away. You know, they can order your stuff right away. Boom. No, nothing extra. You know, so it's like all you have to do is have a good website, good website, good uh, SEO, you know, good SEO. Maybe advertise depending on what it is, where you at, you know, advertising on a social media site or something like that. But. It all, no matter what you do, it comes down to reaching a great amount of people. That's how my books have sold. That's how my, my books have sold. Um, you know, people, I can look my name up. I got a long list of stuff. People like saying stuff and everything. That's the key. So anyway, online businesses, if you have a good product or even a good service, something, depending on what it is. It can be very lucrative because you have a global audience, all right? So anyway, that's all I have for now. Y'all have a good weekend. Let's go make that money.